All right, what's up, y'all? So today I'm gonna take y'all. We're gonna go try out some chicken over here. Let's go. Look, you come down to New Orleans and you want to try out some chicken and you're looking for a good spot, they got a spot, Chaps Chicken, okay, on Metairie Road, right outside New Orleans. Let's go, I'm gonna show y'all what it is. Y'all come to New Orleans, okay? We right outside of New Orleans, right off Metairie Road, all right? So, it's Chaps Chicken, all right? It's a little hidden gem, not everybody knows about it. I know everybody wants to see the famous spots, but you already know about them. So what I'm gonna do is today, I'm gonna show you where you come. When you're in New Orleans, like I said, you get your little Uber, five, six minutes of low ride, get you some real chicken. And plus, remember, well, I couldn't show y'all, but the other day went down there on Decatur Street. It was $10 for two pieces of dark meat, okay? Come check out this menu real quick. Check it out. Eight pieces of chicken for nine bucks. You can't beat it. Look, you get a 16 piece, 15 bucks. Look at all the sides. Jambalaya, coleslaw, red beans, everything, okay? Yeah, check out the back, y'all. You got pole boys, okay? Look, you got roast beef, meatball, hamburger, smoked sausage. Look, check it down. I mean, that's a lot of good food here. And like I said, it's a hidden gym. Not everybody knows about it. I'm gonna show y'all what it looks like. They even got a place you can sit outside and eat, man. It's really nice on a beautiful day. And they got a beautiful inside, okay? So I'm gonna show y'all in a second. Right here, I'm gonna show you. Sarah's gonna show you in a second for less than 40 bucks, okay? Check out this chicken. I mean, come on, look at that. Seasoning on it, you can see it. Not only that, let me tell y'all something. When you come, it's not sitting under no heat lamp, they actually fry it up for you. So you're gonna wait about a good few minutes, not that long 15, 12, 15 minutes, but it's worth the wait. Comes out hot and fresh, it was made for you, okay? It wasn't sitting under no heat lamp, okay? That's why I say it's a hidden gem. How many places are really doing that? Let's be honest. On top of that, look at these red beans and rice. Man. Check out the macaroni. Delicious fries. Let's check it out. Alright, y'all. This chicken's hot, but we're going in and try it. Super crispy, y'all. A lot, a lot of flavor. It packs a lot of flavor. But look at the juice. I mean, you can almost just pour the juice out of it. That's, that's how fresh and delicious it truly is, okay? You can thank me later after you eat it, okay? Let's try out the beans, y'all. Went on. Seasoned perfect, y'all. Creamy. I mean, you even get sausage in your beans here. You know what I mean? So, this ain't like Popeyes or nothing like that, okay? And of course, the mac and cheese, okay? All in all, it's really creamy, delicious. Like I said, like real red beans rice with your sausage and, and your trio on that. I mean, it's, it's got delicious. You can see the chicken, you see the seasoning on it. it comes hot and fresh. Fries, come on, you already know they're good. Um, y'all, it's a hidden gem that some people know about, but a lot of people don't know about it. And like I said, come check them out. See what you think. Uh, see if I'm telling the truth or not. I guarantee if you come once, you're coming back, okay? So, I mean, do remember, I think, I want to say you can call, because I heard somebody call while I was in there, like place an order so they'll be ready when you get here, because the chicken is going to be cooked fresh for you, okay? It's not sitting under the heat lab, all right? So, if you want to call ahead, do so. Chaps Chicken, Metairie Road, right outside New Orleans. We're gonna take a little tour ride down and I'm gonna show y'all some cemeteries up the road. I've seen a few comments, people wanna see it, so let's go. Alright, y'all. So we just left Chaps Chicken. I want to show y'all the cemeteries out here. I know a lot of people have been asking to see them, so let's go. Alright, y'all. So look, the reason you're gonna see these tombstones above the ground, y'all, is because we're so far below sea level. If they put the, the coffins under the ground, y'all, they're gonna pop up because of the water. Okay, so let's go have a look at something. I'll show you what I'm talking about. out here in New Orleans y'all already probably know that they do a lot of cemetery tours and stuff like that I mean this cemetery I'm gonna have Sarah show y'all in a second it literally has streets that you can drive down through the cemetery 
There's tens and tens of thousands of people buried out here, y'all. And a lot of them being is from the 1800s and, and, and way, way back, okay? So I'm going to show y'all some. Just check them out. So just imagine, y'all, that right here inside of here is a coffin. Just right behind this marble is a coffin, okay? It's not under the ground. It's right behind that wall. It lays there to rest. That's it. Yo, look at that. I mean, that's that's old, y'all. That's so old. It's a lot of history. Uh, they actually have to they lock up all the, 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 the graveyards get locked up, y'all. Okay? Because people come out here and it's not stealing stuff. Uh, like, you know how they used to have the brass and uh, the copper things to hold flowers out of respect and come and put the flowers out. People stealing them uh, and going selling to the scrap yards and things of that nature. So now, unfortunately, they got to lock the graveyards down. From what I was looking at, they open from about 8 to 4.30. That's it. Uh, can't come any time in the day or night. Of course, there's a lot of famous people, you know, like we can go see Tom Benson. You got uh, Al Copeland and uh, founder of Popeyes. I mean, you got all kind of people, you know, it's just never ending. But let's look at some more real quick. Now, I'm gonna tell you something that's really cool that you may or may not have seen is they do second lines like somebody passes away they'll do a second line y'all to the person you know to the to the uh, funeral home or to the graveyard or it depends on what, what they pick but they also do mock second lines so if you have a new wallet you can check one of those out they're pretty interesting so if you're not sure what a second line is basically y'all it's like kind of like a marching band and everybody celebrating your life and uh it's like just a big old party down the street you know literally down the streets in new orleans people are you know like i said they got the drums trumpets all this thing umbrellas spinning it's just a big celebration even if you don't know the person you could always join the second line it's pretty interesting and awesome to see so you can definitely check that out if you come down to new orleans okay well, i mean it's, it's pretty different looking and uh, quite interesting let's just give y'all a second i'm gonna just we're gonna just show y'all you know what it is and, uh, let's check it out. I mean, from what everybody says, it's different than you know the way y'all's looks and all that. So I'm talking about look. They had the thing of white right here. Uh, it was copper. See, oh, if not brass, I'm not sure which one. But you can see it was cut off and it's missing. That's why people stealing that man. It's terrible that they steal from the cemeteries, and so that's why they lock them down. That's why you can't just come any time of the day, okay? All right, y'all. So look, we're back in the car. But I'm gonna, Sarah's gonna go ahead and show y'all just so you can get an aspect of how big this place is as we're riding through till we get our way out the gate right there. She's gonna show y'all. So just take a look. Imagine getting lost in this place at nighttime, man. You'd have a heck of a time trying to find your way out, y'all. It's humongous. It's, it's a small part of it. And then, this is on Canal Street. I don't know if I told y'all that. This is on Canal Street in New Orleans, okay? So, there, there's cemeteries everywhere, okay? All right, y'all. So, if y'all enjoyed the video, do me a favor. Hit that like button, subscribe to my channel, and leave me a comment. Let me know what you want to see or what you want to cook next, okay? I appreciate y'all.